Flex, how, what have you made of this whole situation this summer with Cristiano Ronaldo? It's been a roller coaster, hasn't it? It's been a saga, um, which anything to do with a player of the stature of Ronaldo, whether it's an incoming or outgoing, um, is going to be like that. Um, I have to say, I'm quite surprised, uh, in my personal opinion, as a Manchester United fan, getting to the end of the window, and it, and it seems almost certain, like he said there, that Cristiano Ronaldo will still be at the football club. I really thought um, that he would have moved on by now. I know there's been talks about lack of suitors, um, lack of opportunities, lack of, lack of offers there that suit Manchester United and the player. Maybe that's played a part. But one thing that I have to talk about is the fact that the club have been unanimous on this from the start, which is very, very clear. Ronaldo's in the plans. Eric's planning with him. Eric's looking forward to having him as part of the squad. Um, and now, as we've got to the latter stages of the, of the window, when more questions are coming about, have you actually spoke to Ronaldo? He's going even stronger and saying, yeah, it's your, it's your vision that you all think he's going to leave. I've spoken to him. Um, he was asked, can he fit into the Ten Hag philosophy? Can he fit into the way he wants to play? He said, yeah, he's a phenomenal player. He can adapt to any system in the world. And I think back to when Martial um, was on loan at Sevilla and it looked like he was potentially going to be out of the football club. And Eric Ten Hag came in and within a few weeks, he just turned it around. Pre-season turned it around. Um, even the, the cameos that, he had, that he's had uh, since the season started. I know he's only played 45 minutes against Liverpool, but that was fantastic. And all of a sudden, the player's future just changed under this manager. And now I'm in the camp of like, you know what? It's still Ronaldo. He's arguably the best player in the world. And you can't write him off turning this around. Now, Eric Ten Hag's been very scathing in, in his match selection so far. Um, you know, we've debated um, in different bits of content about is Eric Ten Hag leaving Ronaldo out for tactical reasons or is he leaving him out um, because of his future, because it's not sorted yet and he wants to just, to, just some clarity about that. And it looks like maybe it could be the latter, it, you know, because at the moment, Martial is still injured. Um, he's going to stay, look, Cristiano Ronaldo. Um, and then you turn your attentions to tonight. And if he's in the starting lineup and he scores, all of a sudden it, it starts to change. So an unbelievable set of events, an unbelievable outcome, because I really did think that once Ronaldo sorts of makes some noises that he wants to leave, you're trying to go in a new direction. What does an unhappy Ronaldo look like? But it looks like at least till January he's staying. And for Manchester United, if you can get Ronaldo going, fantastic.